15 different microsas examples and for each of them we'll be taking a look at who it was founded by their self-reported revenue and what the product does whether you're looking for your first microsas idea or you're already scaling I know you'll find inspiration in this video. You will also learn what's working out there, which is absolutely crucial. So make sure you stay into the end here. And I think you really like number 11. The first Microsoft product we're taking a look at today is called Email Engine API. It does a self-reported $11,000 a month in recurring revenue, and it was founded by Andres Raymond. And so what this product allows you to do is make it super simple to integrate email into your app or service. It's going to simplify your IMAP and SMTP complexities and focus on what truly matters. And this came from the founder's own problem. They went to go build a Cordova based email app and they realized that handling email protocol stuff inside the app is extremely difficult. And that's why they created this tool. Building tools from your own problems is an extremely useful framework to look at things as you're going to be your own first customer and you're going to have a unique and deep understanding of the problem that your potential users are going to experience. Email Engine API was also number two product hunt, product of the day. So it works with quite a few different systems and they made it super easy to set up. Our second product is called Radar and it's a best in class platform for managing your social media accounts all in one place. It does a self-reported $13,000 a month in recurring revenue, and it was founded by Mustafa. So it's gonna help marketers with every step of their social media process, from scheduling and publishing to analyzing their efforts. Had over 1,000 upvotes on Product Hunt, and it was the 2022 Golden Kitty Award. So it's quite a few features here from publishing to tracking to engaging and analyzing. And they're gonna generate revenue on a monthly basis on a variety of different price points, depending on the number of social profiles you're looking to integrate. Pre.dev is our next product we're gonna take a look at. It hit number two product hunt of the day. It does a self-reported $10,000 a month in revenue. And prior to building this tool, the founder ran a freelance agency and started to get fed up with the amount of time spent on building the statement of work, as well as the project scope for each client. And so that's when they went and built this tool. So it's instant software planning and light speed development. You can chat with the pre.dev AI about your next big idea, and they're gonna help you architect your software. And then you can get it built rapidly with your network of expert engineers. So this tool came from solving their own issue. This saved them tons of time as the tool is gonna to ask the appropriate questions on what the person wanted to build. And once the client answered at least five questions, the conversation is then translated into a knowledge graph representing the idea. And so this allowed them to have full contacts before their first call, saving them a ton of time in the process. And they first built this tool internally, but then realized other people could use it. And so that's when they launched this product. Stage Timer is our next micro SaaS, and it's a remote controlled countdown timer. It was founded by Lucas Herman, and it does a self-reported $11,000 a month in recurring revenue. And so this product was built out of the founder's problem. They went searching for a web timer app for the Spico in their studio recording. And they didn't find a one-click solution. And so that's when they went and built a stage timer. It's trusted by over 9,800 video producers and event organizers. And it lets you keep track of your event with an accurate timer and rundown. And they have over 2 million hours timed and over 140,000 rooms created. This was also a bootstrapped micro SaaS project. And overall, they've been super successful. Karma is our next micro SaaS. It does a self-reported $29,000 a month. And it was founded by Stas. And it's a tool that makes bonding for remote teams better. So you can build stronger, happier teams, set and track goals, and reward excellence on Slack. And it's going to help employers save on staff turnover. And it's used by quite a few large organizations such as Microsoft and VMware. So this is a Slack extension that builds in seamlessly with employees regular day to day. They have some cool features such as micro camera and day to day achievements and teamwork. If you've gotten this far in the video, I'm sure you want to go and build your own SaaS product. I have free SaaS ideas you can steal for free. All you need to do is enter in your email below. Also have a course on how to build your very own micro SaaS. Even if you don't have any SaaS experience or any product ideas, there's a link for this in the description below as well. Next, we have Treble. It's an end-to-end -end API ops platform. There's a self-reported $10,000 a month in recurring revenue, and it was founded by Devor. So it makes it super easy to understand what's going on with your APIs and what apps are using them. So it's definitely gonna be a B2B product, and it's going to be focused on REST APIs and having everything in one place. So let's you automate API development 
with documentation, they have an AI assistance and different endpoint data. We'll take a look at Calendesk next and its appointment scheduling software built for businesses. It's doing a self-reported $17,000 a month and it was founded by Massage. And it's an all-in-one scheduling appointment software built for businesses so you don't have to waste your time arranging meetings and you can streamline your company's workflow automatically. So like most calendar tools, it's going to integrate seamlessly with all your existing ones such as Zoom, Stripe, Google Meet, Messenger, and more. And overall, a super cool tool that's experienced some good growth. And it's definitely one that's very needed out there for many businesses. And I'd say this probably is a crowded space, but it looks like they've really found a good niche here. And they've had over 1 million plus appointments made with Calendesk and they've saved 50% time on operational tasks. Our next micro SaaS is called Churnfree. It does a self-reported $20,000 a month in revenue and it was founded by Bucky James. And it's going to help you reduce churn so you can stop losing customers and keep increasing your revenue by increasing your retention. So it's meant for SaaS, e-commerce, and all subscription-based businesses to retain more customers and reduce that churn rate. And they've helped reduce churn by 46%. Churn's one of those things where it can really creep up on you. If you're only focused on getting new customers and not retaining them effectively, it's gonna make it super hard for your SaaS business to grow or any subscription-based business. They've had over 72,000 cancellations saved they have over 600 customers. In terms of how they generate revenue, it's gonna start at $49 a month, and it's gonna go up to $199, and they do have an enterprise custom plan. Our next micro SaaS is called More Login, and it allows for management of multiple accounts so you don't get banned. It does a self-reported $10,000 a month in revenue, and it's an anti-detect browser that protects your Facebook, TikTok, Amazon, and all other platforms to stop account banning. And this was built because if you're using multiple accounts on different platforms, you can get banned for doing so. And so this is a workaround for that. It's going to use machine learning technology to collect Canvas fingerprint configurations from billions of real users worldwide. That should help easily pass website detections. In terms of revenue generation, it's going to be a monthly subscription based on the number of profiles and users you're looking to use. Our next Microsoft product is called MailRush. It does a self-reported $22,000 a month in recurring revenue, and it was founded by George Monroe. And it's a cold email software that lets you send cold email sequences with no effort. Email is a great way to get new clients and new customers, especially in the B2B space. And this is going to include what looks like all the features you need from email warm-up to email validation and email follow-ups. So you can start building those relationships. Email is one of those platforms that every other year people say is a dying platform, but it has stayed so consistent and people use it all the time. And it's still a great way to get clients. And a tool like MailRush is going to make that process so much simpler. Next, we have SEO Copilot. It's doing a self-reported $10,000 a month in recurring revenue. It was, has two co-founders and Josh and Jebsony. And it gives you Google algorithmic analysis and page quality evaluation, all for SEO or search engine optimization. It lets you dominate the SERPs with SEO. SEO Copilot, so you're going to get on-page SEO solutions, as well as features such as easy AI content generation. And this was founded by Josh, who has strong expertise in this space. Josh has over 20 years of experience in branding, marketing, and digital tech experience, and he's been teaching SEO. And Josh's students have dominated the SERPs with their sufficiently tested SEO tactics. And this tool looks like it's taking all that knowledge that Josh has and putting it into a software tool. We're taking a look at One Take AI next. It was founded by Sebastian Knight. I also did a full breakdown on this video on the channel if you want to check it out. And this tool is going to do all your editing for you. So you just have to take one take even if you have a ton of errors and it's going to use ai editing that's going to do all that work for you turning your raw footage into a finished product it's going to add things such as titles transitions and animations making that process so much easier they're doing a self-reported forty two thousand dollars a month in recurring revenue and overall it's a super cool tool as it also allows for things such as translations into different languages projection lab was founded by kyle nolan and it lets you build financial plans that you will love it does a self-reported twenty four thousand dollars a month in recurring revenue and it was built out of Kyle's own problem. They had trouble finding a finance simulation tool that could actually model things in enough detail to ditch the spreadsheets. And that doesn't make you link real financial accounts, so that's a security risk. So they decided to build this tool. This microsats is also completely bootstrapped and it lets you visualize your whole life. So you can drill into each simulated year in detail 
analyze estimated taxes, cash flow, drawdowns, and more. Next, we have Saha. It was founded by Alex Dallenberg. It does a self-reported $10,000 a month, and it's a mental and physical health API. It's going to integrate with all the wearables from Apple, Garmin, WAP, Aura, and Fitbit, and more. And so they're creating the infrastructure and backend for any application that wants to use this type of data. And so it's going to simplify that whole development process. So rather than having to, to go and develop it again, you could use something like this tool. For our final example, this one's called Aura, and it's an all-in-one agile task management and team collaboration tool. It was founded by Basile, and it does an estimated $12,000 a month in revenue. So you can get more done with your team and you can make every task count and you can get your team 25% more organized and save up to two hours a week. In terms of how they generate revenue, they're gonna have a free forever for up to 10 users. And it's gonna go up in price as the team size grows and you're looking for more features. And this tool was built from the founder's own problem. They went through 10 different other tools similar to this. They weren't satisfied with any of them, so they went and built their own. And they have tons of great reviews here. If you've gotten this far in the video, I'm sure you wanna go and build your own SaaS product. I have free SaaS ideas you can steal for free. All you need to do is enter in your email below. I also have a course on how to build your very own micro SaaS. Even if you don't have any SaaS experience or any product ideas, there's a link for this in the description below as well with people really loving the tool. So this is gonna conclude the video. We went over 15 different examples and I hope you enjoyed the content. If you liked any of these, I would love it so much if you smash that like and subscribe button below. I'm coming up with new SaaS content all the time, so if you're interested in the space at all, you should make sure you're subscribed. I also have tons of other videos covering SaaS examples and topics just like this, so make sure you check out the channel. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in my other videos.